What's up boys? Back out here. Uh, just doing some maintenance on the Huracan because I am taking this thing on a road trip. I'm super excited about it. By the time you guys see this video, I've already left and been back. I have to go down south for something. Really don't want to talk about it, but I want to take the Huracan. Actually put some miles on it. I have done a full service on it. I already did a video on like the oil change and stuff like that. You can go back and rewatch that if you want to know how. There's eight drain plugs. I also had it at Mag Lamborghini a couple days ago to service the transmission because that's something I can't do because you have to have like a $60,000 computer just to tell it that you're adding fluid to it and check the temp and all this other weird stuff. So that's all good. Transmission's all filled up. I just been going over this whole thing with the fine tooth comb for the past like couple days. This thing needs a real good detail. I got some vinyl that's gonna go on it. I'm gonna put like a little quick livery. I've been working with a wrap company, but they're not gonna be able to wrap the whole car before I have to go. But when I come back, we're probably doing a whole wrap on this car, it's gonna be sick. I got someone that's driving down with me in another vehicle, like kind of like a spotter, I guess, if you wanna call it that. But I also got radar detector, dash cam with GPS. I don't know how much I wanna say because I think in a couple of states that I'm gonna be going through, it may or may not be illegal, allegedly. But, I mean, it won't be too hard to figure out. I had to take the front bumper off to add a couple other things. I am pumped about taking this thing out for once. Everybody on YouTube constantly, constantly says that the Huracan is the best road trip, best daily driver supercar out right now. And you guys know I'll be honest with you. Over the next couple of videos, we're gonna be road tripping this thing. It'll be something like 5,000 miles total going down there and coming back. But yeah, let's go up in the air real quick. Just show you the underneath this thing. If you haven't seen it. There's usually these trays and it's just a flat bottom. But here it is all open if you care to see it. Here's the engine that kind of just stays open. There's the belts. Oil change, you got eight drain plugs. One, two, three, four. You gotta take this panel back off. I got it back on right now though. There's the oil cooler right there you gotta do. Here's six, seven, eight is up there. And it's a dry sump, so you can't overfill it. I've just been going over every single thing. Brakes are good, they're at 10 mil. I've just been checking everything with a fine tooth comb. The only thing that sucks about this flat bottom is that you always suck up so much rocks. The only other thing I might do before I take off is go in there and try to straighten up a couple of those fins here and there. The top is pretty much perfect, but the bottom, it's just open. You just suck in all the, the rocks and everything. You just ding up your fins on your radiators. I think the side ones are pretty good. Yeah, they're covered. And uh, tomorrow I'm going to go get a full detail and throw some vinyl on this thing and it's going to be sick, man. I got some pieces over here. Man, it's going to be a fun ride and I'm excited to bring you guys along with me. I honestly don't know if this is the beginning of a video or how much I've recorded. Pretty much taking the Huracan on my own little rally on my own little road trip. It's gotta go to a detail shop and get some vinyl put on it. This thing is filthy. Look at this. I know a bunch of you guys are gonna be mad at me, but watch this. It's crazy filthy. I've been driving it in the rain, everything. So it needs a full detail. Wheels are just disgusting. Going to take it to full throttle details. They're gonna give me a full detail. Throw some vinyl on it. We're good to go, boys. I'm gonna give you a cold start. We're gonna run to the detail place. Thing sounds amazing. I say it every time. I haven't got like a little generic Amazon like cup holder in between the seats. It actually like fits perfect. Like it was almost made for the Huracan. I've tried to use those in other cars before and they're usually too small or too big. And that thing just fits perfectly in there. Boys, I'm here at Full Throttle Detailing in North Kent, Ohio. Thing's filthy. And like I said, I got some vinyl. Kind of little like race livery I want to put on it before I go on the road trip. I was going to stay here and film, but they're like super busy. So I'm just going to drop the car off. I left them with the GoPro Hero 6. They said that they'd give me some shots before or after all that fancy stuff so hopefully it comes out good i'll do my best at editing whatever footage they get for me 
Look at that Lambo, bro. Okay. Do good, do great, and they talk bad on you. No need, no face, cause they're not factual. I won't stay too long here, I'm just passing through. I might hit the bank and get a bag or two. My mama asked me why you got that cash room. Second you switch up, they might get mad at you. No, you're not my friend, so no, I'm taxing you. You are like my sons, I'm going dad on you. Okay, good job, good job. Get my no prob. Hit my line, you're irking me. I hit that woosa. No, I don't got perks on me. I sleep good on God. Spend that money, make it reappear. I've been getting paid. I've been eating good. I've been putting us away. Like a baby, cause I know my paper straight. Oh, I got it. Another day to the grave. I get it, cause I got to. I got kids. Damn, boys. I was so excited. I forgot to pick up the camera. Make sure you follow them on Instagram, Full Throttle Detailing. I'll put a link down in the description. This looks better than the day I got it. I know it's not coming across on camera, but like even these wheels. Like I forgot how nice these wheels look. It looks exactly how it did when I got them out of the box. And I've done pretty good, cause I don't see any curb. Did you see any curb? The only problem that I can point out is this stupid brawl that someone put on when they first got the car. It's still all jacked up. It's got to come off. I'm just, at this point, what, you think it'll pull paint at this point? I don't think so. We should be all right, but that's kind of one of those things. You never know until you tear into it. So. Yeah. Most of them don't, though. Dang, boys. These decals are sick. Now, this is just temporary because I'm kind of in a rush to hit the road. I'm going to do a full wrap, and it's going to be sick. You guys are gonna have to wait to see that. Hopefully, by the time I come back, we can get rolling on something. Dude, this thing is spotless. It has never been this clean. All right, boys, I actually think this is gonna be the end of this video. I honestly don't know where I'm at because I've been all over the place the past week and a half trying to just get ready to go. I think this video is just going to be getting the car ready for this road trip. I'm leaving right this second, but I think it's gonna be in the next one. Don't forget to hit that like button. Don't forget to leave a comment. Don't forget to subscribe if you're not subscribed. Don't forget all the rules if you're wanting to enter the intercooler giveaway. And I will uh, see you guys in the next one. We should be cruising down the street. Deputy Jenny with the Sheriff's Office. I got a couple firearms. I got one right there.